My name is Rosie Hamilton and I'm one of the St Peter's Cathedral tour leaders. I'm delighted today to have the opportunity to introduce you to a little known 19th century benefactor, a woman who was called Lady Unknown. If you've visited the cathedral office, you may have noticed this portrait. You may have wondered who she is and why she is there. It's a portrait of Baroness Angela Burdett Coutts. In 1846, she gave a gift of 35,000 pounds for the endowment of the Church of England in Adelaide. This was a vast sum of money. You may wonder how a young woman who was 32 years old had so much money to give away. As the granddaughter of Thomas Coutts, Angela inherited a 50% share of Coutts Bank when she was 23 years old. Forbidden by 19th century social convention from being involved in business, she channeled her energies into philanthropy. Her most renowned philanthropic work was in East London, where she poured money into redevelopment, building homes for the poor. Her philanthropy was as diverse as it was generous. The full extent of it will never be known, as often her accounts simply record the sum and the description donation. When her parents died in 1844, Angela decided that a fitting memorial to her father would be a new church in one of the most deprived areas of London. St Stephen's Rochester Road was built with no expense spared. The spire was made excessively tall so that it could be seen from her Piccadilly home. Throughout her life, she was interested in people. She met an astonishing range of leading figures of the day who became admiring friends. One of them was Charles Dickens. With him, she set up a home and rescue centre for prostitutes and fallen women. Some successful women from this project were sent to Adelaide. Bishop Short, who owed his position to Angela, was very willing to undertake keeping a watchful eye on the women sent here. When Bishop Short returned to England, he showed Angela photographs of Adelaide's Cathedral and various churches. She was very pleased with what he had achieved in Adelaide. In May 1871, Queen Victoria made her the first woman ever to become a baroness in her own right. She was also the first woman to be given the freedom of London and cheered by the people as Queen of the Poor. She died on the 30th of December, 1906, aged 92. A simple memorial to Angela Burdett Coutts can be found close to the west door at Westminster Abbey.